Hello, thank you for tuning in. I have um, information, a little literature information. What should you know before adding an authorized user to your credit card? An authorized user is someone you authorize to use your credit card and it sets other account features. But just like any favor, it could have some negative consequences for you. Adding an authorized user to your credit card account is easy to do, and it can be a great way to help a friend or family member improve or establish credit. Plus, it can even help you earn rewards. When you add an authorized user to your credit card, you may be doing the person a huge favor, but there can be some negative outcomes. Two, here are some key things you should know before you take the lead. How to add an authorized user. Depending on your credit card issuer, it may not cost anything to add an authorized user to your credit card. But note that adding an authorized user could come with an additional annual fee. Simple contact your issuer to add the new user's information. Typically, that involves verifying a few details like authorized user's date of birth and social security number. Your authorized user can have a separate credit card to use, but it's up to you to decide if you want to give that person that much access to the account. Benefits of adding an authorized user. Help someone get fresh start. When you add an authorized user to your credit card account, information from the account can show up on the person's credit report. Reports. That means their credit can improve if the information is positive. Simply as a result of being added to an account, you keep in good standing. For people with no credit or poor credit, or people who've had their applications for credit denied, becoming an authorized user can be one of the few ways to start building a better credit. Bear in mind that not all issuers provide information about authorized users to the three major consumer credit bureaus, TransUnion, Experian, and Equifax. So if your goal is to help a friend or family member improve their credit and your issuer whether they report authorized user account information to three major consumer credit bureaus, drawback of adding a authorized user. Credit mistakes can be damaged. Your positive account information can help an authorized user build and or rebuild credit. But if you make mistakes or practice negative credit habits, you could potentially hurt that person's credit too. If you miss credit card payments or rack up a big balance, both you and your authorized user credit can take a hit. Similarly, if the authorized user racks up charges on your card, it could negatively impact your credit. Does adding an authorized user hurt your credit? Adding an authorized user to your credit card account alone should not have a negative impact on your credit. But keep in mind that if a person uses your credit irresponsibly, negative credit impact could follow. Share access to your credit account information. This access an authorized user has 
can vary by card issue. For example, Discover states that an authorized user can request account information, including copies of billing statements. That means that person can see information about how you're using your card, including when where you made purchases. Additionally, when an authorized user pulls the credit report, that person may see similar account specifics, like how much you owe on the card and whether you're current on your payments. Slowly responsibility for all charges. Adding authorized users on your account can make it easier to cash in on points or other rewards, but it can also mean taking a bigger financial risk. At the end of the day, regardless of who makes the purchases, you and you alone will be responsible for paying the bill. For that reason, it is important to choose an authorized user you trust to use your account responsibility. Bottom line, remember how intimidating it was to get your first credit card. Maybe it took you a while to learn how to use it responsibly, responsible, and you may make mistakes along the way. According to someone you trust as an authorized user, maybe your child or another family member could help that person get off to an easier start. An authorized user can learn good habits with less risk while starting to build or rebuild a positive credit history. Just remember that it's two-way street. An authorized user credit habits can impact your credit as well. Okay, this is part one. I will be I will be doing part two later sometime. So I hope this is some great information for you. Okay, so this is about if you want to add someone onto your um, credit line, this is very important information. So I want you to take heed and think about it carefully. You know, if you're a person, you pay your bills on time. You know, then because if you don't pay your credit card bills on time, then that could affect that person that you add to your credit line. So take that in heat, you know. Okay, so this is it for this video. Take one. Okay, so now I can go and laugh. You know what I'm saying? I've just, I tried so hard to keep laughing, okay? I'm going to keep it real with you. I just got to get this laugh out, okay? See ya.